What is up guys, welcome back to another adventure. As you can see, we are at this bungalow. It has been abandoned for some quite time. And as you can see, the grass here is almost as tall as my stomach area. That's how long it's been abandoned. No one's taking care of the property. Look, even that, poor little light. But without further ado, oh my God, we have a couch. Guys, get your popcorn, sit down, get ready to chill, because we are going in. All right, guys, look at this. All these plants are just overgrown. So, and just look at this. The architecture in here, stone. And then we got a nice red door with a peephole. Let's see, can we see in? Yeah, we can. But, before I even go further, someone is here with me. We have Terry here. He's already inside filming, photographing this place. So, I'm gonna walk around this place. I'm gonna show you guys the backyard now, and then I'll end the video up from the inside. So let's just see how un. Oh man, look at how unkept this is. It's a lot of property, guys. And as you can see, there's a busy road right there. So. I'm gonna show you guys how long the grass is in the back. This right here is what we call a tick's dream place. I hate the ticks, but. Look at this big, nice window. Oh look, we have a door open. Ooh, look at this kitchen. So outdated, even the stove. We got a nice whirlpool. What do you guys think? I say early 2000s, possibly. Um, oh, look at the backsplash here. Nice. Like even if you're just in here cooking for your family, you could have you have kids in the backyard, you're cooking here, washing dishes, watching them. This would be a perfect place for a pool. So, look at this amazing dresser. This looks very nice. What is it still doing in a house like this? I don't know. So, this could be like the sunroom. Oh, I got some books here. What is that? That's like a little uh, trailer thing for a kid to sit in and you pull it. Wow, nice. Let's see if we find Terry around. Oh, this is outside. This is an add-on. Let's get my light going. Oh, this is a garage, obviously. Not too much here in the garage. That one is open, but there's a board in the front. So. It's a creepy little place, I guess. This would be a workshop area. I 
I know you guys like me looking closely at stuff, and I'm probably gonna try to do that in this video if I can. Um, got some tires. Oh, what is that? I'm not gonna show the license plates because it'll show you guys. You guys can probably track the plates and find out where I am. I actually like this kitchen. A little outdated, but it's still cool. Let's see, if I turn the corner, am I gonna see? Oh yeah, there's Terry. What's going on? Don't forget guys, his link is down below. Show him some love. We're gonna go to the front door last though, guys. I'm gonna go to the far room here. I think this is like a little office area. Right in here. Yeah, I thought so. Well, it's a bedroom actually. Nice. If you shut this properly to present it, it's actually very nice. That is Lewis Closet. That is the other door from the outside. Look at the paint peel on the door. Let's see. Got a toilet, sink is ripped out. Oh, look at that little mini window. That's kind of cool. Um, probably had a window, uh, not a window, a mirror right there. Small little room, probably kids room, but at least you can see outside. Like the front door area. Look how long that grass is, guys. Even the front is Tickville. Wait, what's that? I don't want to touch that. Scotch whiskey. Damn. Minus. If you guys know that brand or if you've tried that brand, I want you guys to comment down below. Tell me if it's a strong one, if it's good. I'm curious, I've never, I don't try whiskey, it's probably too strong for me, but I'd like to know your response if you guys have had it before. Another empty bedroom, got lots of decay. <clears throat> I actually like this right here, the three pillars. Uh, that would have resembled something, but it doesn't mean more. I like this big bay window right here. A lot of big windows to shine out, like shine to look outside and even for natural light to come in. But this is cool because, like I said, if in the kitchen, you can see the backyard from here. And if you had a pool, kids running around, it's... This is a very good lot for a family. Even though it's only a bungalow, but there's a little bit of a loft area I'm going to show you in a second. But I think it's... For family one, this would be good, but it's just unfortunate they're tearing it down. Terry is not happy with this house. I will light a fire, we'll cook some s'mores. Oh, this looks cool. That, that will cheer me up. I like the three pillars, the, the fireplace here. I see something interesting. It seems that this used to be open concept. You can see the new drywall here. Yeah, I see it. The drywall is covering up these stairs to the basement. If you come over here. What? Yeah, so you come over here, and you have the same style of pillars, but they've drywalled it off on the other side. So all the way up to the front door, it used to be open concept with just the divider wall here. I did not know that. So, a quick tip before we go on. Me, Terry, have already been in this house a long time ago. I lost my footage on a corrupted hard drive. I don't know, do you still have your original from when we came back a while ago? I had to find it, how long ago was that? Three years ago? Two, three years ago? Yeah. Uh, we, we drove by it and we're like, okay, you know what, we want to come in and film it. We, I can't remember anything about this house, but I do remember those stairs, because we took a picture on those stairs of me, Ethan, Terry, and D-Dog Vlogs. Someone has that picture, 
Look through all those guys' Instagrams and you'll definitely find it. Ethan most likely has it, I think. But I'm pretty sure Ethan does, yeah. Yeah. But yeah, you think this is the stairs that go down, eh? Let's uh yeah. let's open the wall and find out. No, I'm just joking guys. We don't break this shit. We just film it. This would have been the alarm panel right there. This is that nice little door that I kind of peeked through before earlier. Oh, here's another set of stairs. It's the basement. As you can hear, guys, there is water leaking down there. I'm gonna try to go down this way and see how far we can go. Terry's not coming down. He already told me. And if I remember correctly, this is gross down there. Yeah, it is. Oh! <laughs> yeah. Sticks. Guys, it stinks really bad. Look at this mold. This mold definitely was not here before. No, it wasn't that bad. We knew the water damage was here, but the mold definitely not. Guys, I'm plugging my nose, so if I talk like uh, Steve Urkel for a little bit, I apologize. Oh, out of the bathroom. The carpet. Oh, I have to step in it. It's got some paintings with mold all over it. It's got the DVD player. Guys, I remember this floor being a little more wet. I'm pretty sure Ethan or D-Dog will comment on this because they'll remember this house. And I hope they do because I don't remember this much mold being in here. So, I am going a little bit fast in the basement. Uh, I don't have my mask and plugging my nose probably just isn't the best. But... Outside, breathe some fresh air. That was pretty bad, but pretty bad. <clears throat> overall, it's a decent house. Like I said, it's on a, a decent piece of property, is what I think. So, what do you think? I know you don't like the house, but uh, property-wise, it's good. It's a lot of well, land. I like it. When I'm looking at it from this angle and picturing it from this open concept, it would have been really nice with this fireplace, that nice staircase up to the loft. Oh yeah, it go there. Yeah, it would have been a really nice open concept place. Don't like it that they closed that off. See, when we came here before, that was that open or was that still closed? I don't remember. Pretty sure it was closed off. So. Hmm. All right, guys. So we are going up in the loft. I remember this is the first step was loose, so I'm skipping it. And if I'm not mistaken, one of these might be loose too. Wasn't it, Terry? I think so. No. Definitely a squatter here. Got a nice bathroom. This is a loft. This is right here, perfect for a bed. So. I don't know if it's got power, this thing. I don't know. I don't think it's got power. Ish. No power. All right, we have a bathroom right beside those funky little stairs. Nice shower size. So, that is it. I think that's about it for this house, guys. It's pretty dope, like I said.
when I came in guys I was kind of rushing the back because I didn't want to step in these stay long in here but I'm gonna give you a nice view of this stuff right here like I said this is perfect for a kid family you know what I mean you get the big bay windows all along that room the kitchen right here where Terry is and that's where the other master bedroom is but I hope you guys enjoyed this video and end it off right here thank you all for watching go subscribe to Terry show him some love let's get him up to how many subscribers you have a couple hundred uh, just over two Let's get, let's get him to 500 right now. Come on, guys. I know you guys can do it. Ready? Three, two, one. Subscribe to him. And if you haven't su su subscribed to me, check me out to subscribe. Turn the bell on for notifications so you guys know when I upload a video. My social media, I'll be down below. You guys will know where I am any time of the day. If you guys are in my area, you guys want to film with me, you guys just got to hit me up. That's all you got to do. But you guys know how it is. Keep it real. Stay positive. I'll see you next time. Peace.